Carolina Insider. It's presented by Wells Fargo, official sponsor of Carolina Athletics. And brought to you by Coca-Cola. When you're stocking up for game day, be sure to grab a Coke with a friend. Together, taste better. Carolina Ford. Ford, built for victory. Built for the Carolinas. Contact your Carolina Ford dealer today. And by Hardison and Cochran, attorneys at law, 919 all fours. Hello again and welcome to the Carolina Insider. And man, do we have a jam packed show for you today. So many Tar Heel highlights. We're going to start on the football side of things. Carolina taking care of business on Saturday in Keenan Stadium, 49 to 9, the final score as the Tar Heels vanquish Western Carolina. We'll also go back on the men's basketball side of things and check out some of the action from the Maui Invitational via Asheville, which occurred earlier in the week. And the women's basketball team off to a terrific start. They're 4-0, averaging nearly 95 points per game. We'll see some highlights from the women as well. But we are going to start with the first half in Keenan Stadium on Saturday. It was the only half the starters played, so a bunch of highlights from this one. The first 30 minutes in Keenan against Western Carolina. Ball right on midfield as the heels go left to right. Sun splash field here in Keenan. Ball on the far hash. How for the first time looking deep. Clean pocket to throw. Rips one. Caught at the 35. And coming to the near sideline is Daz Newsom working through traffic and has the first down. Yeah, a handful of games remaining in this season, but last time they'll be in Keenan Stadium. Western brings some pressure. Heels pick it up. Hal dumps it over the middle to his tight end. Walston crosses the 20 and is knocked down at the 17. A gain of 13 on the play. And he'll keep it on the ground to Carter. A lot of space up the middle. 10-5 touchdown. Michael Carter right up the gut for six. Out of the backfield a couple of seasons ago as this time nothing doing for the Catamounts as they hand it off. But a big hit. Des Evans comes into the backfield and lays the hammer down. Javante Williams the back in the game. Standing next to Sam Howe. Howe to throw. Now he'll scramble. Picking his way through the line. Has a first down and more. Sam into Western Carolina territory over the 30 and pushed out of bounds at the 22-yard line on the far sideline. Howe claps his hands once, twice, and now he's going to throw. Right over the middle. Antoine Green snags it. Dives for the score. Antoine Green, his first catch of the season is a touchdown. Newsom will field it at the 25. Newsom coming to the near sideline. He might have some space. Newsom at the 35. Stiff arm at the 40. Cuts back at the 45. Taken down at about the 46. I tell you, that was the punter again, Brandon Dickerson. He's been on the wrong side of a stiff arm from Daz Newsom on each return. What a good second half of the season Simmons has had. Swing past Javante Williams. Buckle up. Here he goes into Catamount territory. Over the 35, over the 30, and Javante inside the 25 to the Western Carolina 24-yard line. So Heels are going to go for it. Fourth and goal at the three, up 21 to three. Howell in the shotgun, claps his hands. He will hand off to Javante Williams, and the seize part for the touchdown. You could have driven a Mack truck through that one, and the human version of the Mack truck, Javante Williams, plowed through it. They have him listed at 6'4", 280, so he's a big dude for a young player. Stretch play to the near side, ball on the deck, and two teams scramble for it. Let's see who has possession. Carolina adamant that it's Tar Heel football. Cameron Kelly forces the fumble, and out of the pile comes the man we were just talking about, Kevin Hester with the recovery. Michael Carter to the right of Sam Howe. 28 to 3 Carolina, 34 to 3 Carolina as Howe hands to Carter who cruises in for his third touchdown of the day. And I believe that is now eight different receivers that have 19 or more yards receiving for Carolina. Howell in total, 19 of 22 for 261. He's going to throw again. Has all day to throw. Lobs it to Newsom. Touchdown. 
just placed perfectly into the arms of the Tar Heel senior for six. 42 to three, heading to the halftime locker.